Hello, Baloo, and howdy do. I'm Sanctor, and welcome back to Third Age Total War Dwarves of Erebor campaign. In the previous episode, we didn't really accomplish much. We got the castle of Ron, even though in the previous episode I renamed it the city of Ron, but it's a castle, whatever. And we, our income is positive, or at least it was, we're losing money now. And in this episode, we are, it's an hour long special, as you can tell by the length of the video. It's going to be weird for me, I haven't recorded an hour long video in who knows how long. So it's going to be interesting indeed, I imagine we'll get a lot accomplished. But before I get into anything, I just want to talk about a few things. So, as we all know, it's been a bit laggy lately. Yeah, you can see how it's kind of like choppy over here. I've messed around with my settings, my recording settings, and hopefully there won't be any issues, and hopefully it will minimize on the amount of lag slash choppiness going on. I think for this region right here, it's just always a bit choppy. Or maybe it's just me and the way my mind works and makes it look like it is. But hopefully that is not the case. Also, one of you... And your name escapes my mind for some reason, even though I have it written down somewhere in this messy desk of mine. Told me that I should get the mines in Erebor. Because, where is it? Where are my mines? Right here. Because it provides a large amount of income, which I overlooked last time, and yes, indeed, it does. You also said something along the lines of the reason why the dwarven miners, these ones when free upkeep was because I didn't have the mines. But my question is, it it doesn't say you can recruit miners in here, so I don't know if I believe that. Although it would make sense that miners would be free upkeep when you have mines. So I'm going to try to construct that as soon as possible. Now, I don't want to get rid of anything. I'll get rid of that to kind of like get some money. But things that are already in the process of being built, I'll leave those alone. Uh, where's the place? Maybe I can destroy some of the orc buildings to get a little bit of money. It gives me public order. And that gives me income, so maybe I won't do that. But I'll try to get those mines as soon as possible. And another thing that I decided I wanted to do was... Like, if this hour-long episode continues to be a good thing and everyone likes it, then I will definitely decide to do more in, like, out of order. Instead of every five episodes, I'll set, during the beginning of each episode, I'll say, Hey, if this video gets X amount of likes, the next video will be an hour-long special. On, on top of every five episodes being hour-long specials, of course. But I guess then they wouldn't really be specials. So, every video that has been uploaded so far has had roughly 7 likes, which isn't that much. So I'm thinking if this video can get 10 likes before the next episode, before I record the next episode, and this episode will come out, and then tomorrow won't be Erebor, and then the next day will be Erebor, so you have like today and tomorrow to get this video up to 10 likes. If it reaches that goal, the next episode will be another hour. And then of course, the amount of likes that will be required will go up and up and up. I'm setting the bar low at 10. But let me know what you think about that. And uh, yeah, I'm probably gonna make another video at some point discussing like, uh, the schedule, like when I'm going to be uploading stuff, but I'm just getting into Isengard and like a week or two from now, I'm probably going to be doing Carthage from Rome 2 or maybe Rome from Rome 2. I definitely want to play Total War Rome 2. Just let me know what faction you want me to play as. I'm leaning more toward Rome because Carthage is hard as hell, but if you want me to play as hard as hell campaign, then Carthage is the way to go. What? That's a lot of talking. I'm already like almost 10 minutes in and we haven't done anything. So, let's get rid of my notes. I don't need that anymore. <sighs> let's get on with it. 
So over here we have Thorin building stuff. Rune is down here, and if Rune's down there, then I assume there's no more rebel territory to conquer. So he'll have to hopefully not get beaten up. You, My lord. you're going to Rome. Up uh, Rome, jeez, already getting confused. You're going to Rohan, and up here. Not too much going on up here. Oh, yeah, you're out doing stuff. My king. Though I might want to send these guys back to get free upkeep. That way, I can get the mines as soon as possible. At least I'm making money now. Or I can just go take Gundabad. At least I'm pretty sure Gundabad's right there. As soon as possible. But I already did end everything before, so let's end the turn now. Woo! That was a very long intro. I hate long intros, but I needed to make sure that everything was said properly. Because if you know me in the videos I've made in the past, I tend to talk and then forget, get distracted and forget what I was talking about. A good example, in the Isengard, I just recorded Isengard. That will be going up either an hour from now or a couple hours from now, or it has already been uploaded. I'm not sure which one I'm going to do first. But in there, in that episode, I talk about me having a pop filter, and I should really have my pop filter on right now. Instead of five feet away from me, I'm looking at it right now, guess what? I totally forgot to hook it up again. So, that's something I need to do. Alright, we're making money. That's that's good. I'll take it. Uh, yep, stalled. Oh, sorry, Rohan. I'll, I'll come to you eventually. I, my lead. Let's continue to make that and get your butts in there. I should. Can I recruit a spy anywhere? Anywhere? Spy, please. Diplomat, spy. In Erebor. Right. Agent limit reach. Oh, that's great. But I should have another. Diplomat, right? Yes. All right, you. Let's go talk to Always Dale. Always happy to deal with you, trusted friend. App information, old buddy, old this pal. Proposal is of e. Okay. How about instead of nine hundred and forty gold, I give you five hundred. It's good to see. Ah, good. Thank you, King Bane. You are a good man. Until we meet again. Oh yeah, the, all the rebel territory is done with. All right, so let's see about talking to Thranduil, getting some map information there. Now that I actually have territory and I have a little bit of money, which I probably shouldn't have spent that money. Gosh darn it! Then that means I'll be getting map information, which isn't necessary, but I do like knowing where my enemies and allies are. Now what to do with you guys? If I can get a peace treaty with Rune, that would be fantastic, because then I can focus primarily on the goblins. Because there's no way I'll be able to recruit a bunch of people. Well, actually, Karakhan Gathal, they have some good people, though it takes a long time to recruit any of them. Uh, hello. Oh, they're my allies. I'm not worried about them. They ain't gonna attack me. So there's no way I'll be able to fortify the east for war against Rune. Not with the territories that I have. Why do you guys hate me so much? 65. There's no way they're going to go to war with me, right? They're not going to rebel. I'm making a lot of money. So I think I can afford to get a pipe haul. So I get that extra bonus. Because I don't want them to rebel on me and stuff. I, my liege. As far as you guys are concerned, miners are useless. Yeah, Can I recruit anyone in here? I can. I don't know if I want to. 340, 300, 260, 310. 
They're not even that great, Dale Cavalry. But they're cavalry, which is good. Alright. Yeah, go talk to Rohan. Oh, Isengard. What's Isengard doing in Rohan? Is there something I can do for you? No, I don't want an alliance with them. Or do I? Let me know in the comments if I should align myself with the Dominion of Isengard. I do want trade rights though. Your plans something else you'd like to suggest? Ew, demanding, huh? Um hmm. I will give you five hundred gold. Because I'm curious what you are doing. Do not think our people accept Barely accepted. Maybe I should go down to 400 gold. Yeah, I don't care. Y yeah, I don't care. Y yeah, I don't care. Oh, yeah. Isengard is doing quite well for itself. Turn 18 and they're doing pretty good. And the Ents haven't killed them yet. Because that's always something I've noticed when playing as a different faction. Around this time, Isengard gets his butt kicked by the Ents. Hopefully... Eric here and the team of Divide and Conquer fix that. And of course now I'm low on funds. That's fantastic. Did I already do him? Yeah, I already did him. Okay. Here's the plan. Get the mine. Save up money, get the mines. Recruit an army. Attack Gundabad. Well, I guess I could send the miners out there just to see how they're doing. But well, let's just end the turn. We've destroyed the Orcs of the Misty Mountains quite easily so far. So maybe I don't need a huge army to defeat them. Maybe I just need my generals and just like one or two other units to do it. Though that is risky if they have a large army I notice that and I'm like, ah, crap, I gotta go back, and then they attack me and kill me. That would be bad. What should it be? One more turn before I get the mines? I think I can wait one more turn. Ah, bro, the Galadrim, very good. So they're more prone to give me map information. Okay, good. They are not going to rebel. Excellent. And I can't do anything here except hope that they don't rebel. Alright, how about an alliance, eh? This no? Alright. Well. How about map information, eh? Let's not take this any further. Oh, Thranduil, you're a thorn in my this buttocks. Was disappointing. Goodbye. Indeed it was disappointing. Next turn. I'll get a map information next turn. Alright, you. Lurts. Oh, you going after... You wish there, huh? An alliance? I must no? Say okay. Trade rights? Let's not take this what the answer. hell, people? You know, Rohan, this meeting you are being beaten back by Isengard, Goodbye. and it doesn't look like you're putting up much of a fight. You know, an alliance with the dwarves would be in your favor, especially with trade. I can give you some of my weapons, and you can use those weapons to defeat your enemies, because, you know, dwarves create fantastic weapons. Just saying. But no, you don't want any part of me, huh? You have nothing to do with me, neither does Thranduil, the jerk-offs. Uh, Helm's Deep, don't care. Uh, okay, I can survive one more turn not doing anything. So try again with Thranduil, offer them some money. Try again with Rohan, offers them some money. Assuming I have any money after I build the mines. That didn't sound good. And then... Then what? I'll probably send the guy that's in Rohan to Eriador, that region, and the other guy to... Who are you? Remnants of Agmar. Hey, you want peace? I'll take peace. Wooded Realm? What are you doing, Woodland Realm? My lord. You have oh, wait, wait, wait. Ah, crap. You. Now that I did that, yeah. Ah, oh, and it doesn't matter because... I've already done it, didn't I? Yeah. Well, shoot. So I just wasted his turn. That was fantastic. Although, with only 343 gold, it probably didn't matter. Your you have a Trade rights. You hold us at, at least you accepted and this time. Very well. what else do you have Map information. No, we will not agree to anything ah. like this. 
150, so 300 gold. Yeah, that's perfectly acceptable. It was a fair deal. Good day. Indeed, it was a fair deal. To you. Oh, but they have taken Eastern Mold. It's pretty good for them. All right, so Dunland. Jeez, stop getting stuck. So go to Dunland, go to the clans of Enidwaith, and then make your way north. You wasted your turn, so you're useless. Uh, I haven't been moving these guys, have I? Well, that's gonna that's gonna sting a little bit. Oh, oh! I should have looked at you first. Ah, oh, three turns. Okay, it takes you two turns at least, so I could intercept you. If I wanted to recruit some people and probably destroy you. you. Oh, you just did. Twice. So shut the hell up. As far as this place is concerned, I have the mines building right now. So... Honor, my lord. I'll continue Honor. with him. We'll rest here the night, sire. Even though it really doesn't matter in the north, my OCD is going to make me want to claim the north. So if I send everyone out, they will not be mad at me. I'll take it. My king. And we will try to take Gundabad. Alright, we're making progress. We are making progress. Let's end the turn again. I hate not making progressive turns, like not doing much. But at this stage, there's not much to do. Except for all this background stuff. My diplomats are doing work. I was saving up for the mines, which I now got. We're in the process of getting. So I can now do more stuff. Agmar. The Iron Crown and Agmar still cast a pale and awful shadow in the midst of the land above the spines of Carton Tomb. Iron Crown, Shadow, and Tendrils. That sounds fantastic. Six hundred to destroy the weakness that they had. No wretch escapes its scorn. Huh. So, Agmar is kicking some butt. Agmar is kicking a butt. Isengard's kicking butt. I wonder if Mordor is kicking butt. Alright, Dunland. Perfect, that's where I'm going. My lord. Yes, sire. Well, it's a little more north than I want. I don't care. Ooh, losing money. I did just send, like, all of my guys out to go to war. So that's not good. Alright, Randwell, we already have trade, right? So... Oh, you accepted! Alright, I don't have to give you anything! No money for you! Any... any uh, how about an alliance? Let's not attack each other, no? Alright. They haven't really been doing much at all, have they? Um... Yes, sire. Remnants of no shadow. It's not remnants. Shadow of Mirkwood. See if I can talk to them. Oh, when did that get there? Oh, they disappeared. Does that mean I'm safe to continue oh. my stuff? Aye, I'm gonna hope so. Set a watch. We come here until morning. Alright, so Thorin's doing his thing. You're doing your thing. Oh, and you're just out. What a waste. And you're over there. Can I get any buildings anywhere? Steelmonger. I'll have to come back to that, see if there's anything else that I need. Uh, you... Ironmonger. Only takes one turn and it's cheaper. Smoking house. Green exchange though. Can I get both? That and the Ironmonger? Ah, not quite. Oh well. I'll get the green exchange. Trade is a huge part of my income. Well, end the turn again, I guess. It's a good thing this is an hour long special. There's not going to be any battles. Just kidding, there will be battles. I'll assault Gundabad. Maybe attack Rune, well, defend against Rune if they decide to do anything cheeky in the east. I don't know why I keep confusing east and west. I mean, Rune is obviously located here and they're called Easterlings. So obviously east. Very good, very good, very good. Awesome. Glad to hear it. And I'm not losing money. 
Excellent. Glad to hear it. All right. We march to glory. Oh, they're done for. They are done for. Aye, my liege. We march to battle. I've never fought Gundabad, so I don't know how it will, how the map will be, but I assume it won't be that bad. Especially when they only have just a bunch of petty goblins. This guy's the only threat, and he's not even that much of a threat. Isn't that their capital? No, it's just a huge... Ah, Goblin Town's their capital, isn't it? Gundabad. There used to be orcs of Gundabad in here, that's why. And then I think it changed the shadow of, or remnants of Agmar. No, that that can't be true. Huh. The base Third Age game had Orcs of Gundabad, I remember that. And Gundabad had the... I don't know. It's been a long time and I don't care. Can I be of service? Uh... Of course, sire. I'm a well, I guess I could talk to you guys first since you're right there. Tomorrow, sire. Your honor. Yes, All right, what is it you Dunland. To Trade. You hold us at ransom. I don't care if I hold you at ransom. It's um, single payment of three hundred gold. I must say we are not convinced. Oh. Okay, that's a lot of gold. So how about instead of that, I make a single payment of five hundred gold. I do not believe no. able to accept this. Planning okay. To make a more map information for map information. I'll make a regular tribute of 300 gold for two days. That's 600 gold. You guys could really use it. You're bankrupt. I'm nowhere near you. This isn't going ah. to be hope for more fruitful. Well, at least I got dwarven miners. I don't care about any stupid dwarven miners. But at least I have trade with them now. Alright, so now they're free. But I don't have the mine built just yet. I don't know. It's weird. Right, so you go over there. Build some more towers. Oh, hey. Dale. Getting into the fray. I like it. I like it when Dale does good. I actually like it when any factions do good. Because there's too many times where... They hold a few settlements, and then that's it. Sometimes they'll lose one, but then they'll immediately gain it back. And factions just don't die quickly. At least never in the ones that I've seen. Alright, you. My king. Go down there, build a tower. Go down there, build a tower. I, noble sire, setting a vigilant watch here. Yes, indeed. Well, should I bother recruiting people? Probably not. I'll get the Ironmonger this time. Oh, sweet. Another Ironmonger. I believe that's all I can do for now. Everything seems to be going quite well. Alright. And the and the turn. We'll see exactly what our goblin foes decide to do. So talk to Vale of Anduin, see how they're doing. Wonder if the goblins are beating them back since they're not really doing anything for us. Where are you going? Why aren't you helping your Gundabad friends? Alright, so that's not doing well. Construction report. Mordor and the Galadrim. Yeah, that's to be expected. Misty Mountains, that is also to be expected. And Dunlin is good. Does that mean I should try again? You have a proposition for us? Uh, how about a single payment of 300 gold? And a regular tribute of uh, 100 gold for two turns. That's 500 gold. This proposal is of little interest. <clears throat> I don't want to pay a thousand gold for stupid map information. Oh, but the thing went up at least. Single payment. I'll give you half of that. 500 and we'll leave it at that. I must say we are not. Okay, they're going down. 
regular tribute. 300 for two days. No, we will not agree to anything like this. I have a thousand. I can't afford it. Do I want map information that bad? Four hundred, four hundred, two turns. Four hundred, two turns. You hold us at ransom. Okay. And you I don't care. Meet again. Don't care. Ugh. I sorry. Now I gotta talk to the clans in the end, at least. Jeez, some crackers. Dunland was just not giving up. Hopefully the money I give them will help them do stuff. I know it's a terrible thing to say because of the bad guys, but I don't care. I'm a bad guy, too. Where's my other diplomat? Oh, yeah, he's down here. Your Honor, opening talks with their dignitary, sir. Ah, uh, he's a rebel. What is it you wish to discuss? Map information? I mean... You hold us at ransom. Yay, an alliance! I did it, everyone! I did it! What you have to suggest? I must say, we are not convinced. Uh, sure, but only if I also get ma uh, that stuff. Seems like a most reasonable good day to All right. Me. They're doing quite well for themselves. Well, uh, it's all the way down there. So there has to be a settlement around here somewhere. Yay, Anduin! They're never gonna betray me. Yay. Alright, I should probably attack Gundabad now. My king. Oop, I don't mean to do that. Uh, Steelmonger, why not? Well. So next turn, well, after this turn, the mines will finally be done. Just move everyone around and then attack Gundabad. I, my liege, marching now. I, All right. noble sire, let the fall of Gundabad begin. By your will, sire, we shall engage. Or they get a garrison. That's cool, too. Well, never mind. I need reinforcements. Sorry. Sorry to get your hopes up. I can get those guys to come help me out. What was the building? Steelmonger, perfect. So, Dane's Halls. Yeah. Get those guys. And I can't get any reinforcements. Oh, I don't want to wait too long. Even The smart idea would be to wait until those nine turns are up because they keep losing people but it's getting boring we're halfway done and I haven't done any battles at all that's unacceptable the things are looking up I'll probably have to create a small I'll have to create a small army in this area, just in case of room decides to be crafty. But I think Dale has got me covered there. Alright, clans on the end of the way. Perfect. That's exactly where I was going. A proposition for us? Trade rights. You hold us at ransom. I don't care. For us, then? Demanding. Single payment of 300 gold. Since you are bankrupt, you could use the money. No? Okay. I will give you a single payment of 500 gold. You could use the money. No, how about an alliance? No, didn't think so. Um, uh, jeez, what do you want from me? No, we will not agree. 700 gold for like two this. turns. Oh, we're going through this again for a faction that doesn't matter. Single payment of 700 gold. That's more than I've done for a lot of people, alright? 
I must say, we are not. Alright, 600 gold for two turns. We're, we're getting somewhere. How about... I will give you 300 gold now. And a regular payment of 300 for two turns. That's 900 gold. Isn't that the same as what they were? No, they wanted 600 for two turns. I am not quite able to accept this. This had best be more worthwhile. Fine, the 600 for the thing. I'll just give you 700 right now. What do you say Let's to that? Not take this any. This was a waste of time. Oh, I, I forgot. I get 500 from this, so that's an extra 500 I could have used. Next turn. Next turn. All right. What was I doing? So I got these guys. Send them to go help. We've marched our limit. I keep pressing the wrong button. I keep wanting to press construction. And I do recruitment. That's not right. I, noble sire. We march to glory. I, noble sire. Uh. Watch here. Uh. I should be getting miners' quarters. Yeah, I'll be getting. I'll get miners' quarters. Because now that this place can, I can actually do stuff, I'm going to want to fortify this place, get as much free upkeep as possible. My king. There's no way he's going to make it in time. I will not waste words on you. So it doesn't matter if Thorn goes over there or not. Well, maybe it does. Do I really need him over here? I mean, it's not like they're gonna attack. My king. I don't care. I'm gonna do it. We'll rest here the night, sire. I want all my borders to be highlighted. Ah, they get free upkeep though. Should I send them? You know, I need all the people I can get. March. We march no farther today. Aye. And they're still losing people. Excellent. Oh, crap. Forgot about him. Not a big deal. So sorry for the... lack of doing anything. This is the point in the game where... I have to fortify everything and... Oh, th thank you, Council. Oh, you're all so handsome. May your beards never grow thin, like my head. My lord. Yeah, I'm going bald. Aye, sire. It's not fun. Yes, sire. Of course, sire. Where the hell are you guys? Shadow Mirkwood's around here somewhere. New family member, diplomatic information. Oh, my. Really? And the way than Gondor allies. If anything, the clans and the Dunlans should be allies going against Bree. But I guess not. Well, that's gonna make things more difficult for me. What is it you wish to discuss? Map information for map information. I will give you a single payment of five hundred gold. This proposal is of little Three turns? That's more than you were asking before! I know you're at war, but jeez Louise. All right, regular tribute, 400 gold for two days, or 300 gold for three turns. That's 900 gold. No, we will not agree to anything. 700 like for this. two turns. What was the previous one? Was it 500 for? Do I want map information that badly? Oh, do I want it that badly? Regular tribute. 500 for two turns. That's a thousand gold. Sure that you could do that. I do not believe I'm able to accept this. 
you're you're playing. You're, you're playing with me. Thirteen hundred. You're you're playing. I guess I could cancel it. You know, what? yeah, I'm gonna accept it. Glad we. I'm gonna immediately cancel it. Well, the next Farewell, chance I get. So talk to them next turn and then head north. As far as you're concerned, I think you're already done. You go build that and start doing stuff. Yeah, they're they're about to attack. Crap. Crap. Crap on a stick. Dale! They're, they're right there. When you want to help order. out, please. My king. King oh, that's here, way son. too long. That is way too long. I, my liege. In your name, sire. I, I wonder if Gurren's actually going to make it to Ron before Thorn does. That would definitely be interesting. Move out. That'll do. I Ooh. Have a taste of my blade. Ooh. That's not good. That's not good at all. If I hide in the trees, are they gonna attack me or are they just gonna go back? I could just take them. Those aren't going down at all. Is anything even going down? I don't think anything is going down. It's gonna take two turns. Two turns before I'm able to get reinforcements. Do I even need the reinforcements? Ah. This is stressful. It's more stressful than it needs to be. God damn it, stop pressing the wrong button. Steelmonger, steelmonger. Screw it, steelmonger. I don't care. End the gosh darn turn. I have lousy neighbors. Dunlin and the clans of Enedwaith. Asking too much money. Merkwood and Rohan being jerks at first and they're like, Ah, oh, crap, we shouldn't be mean to them. This place is always, like, against me. Move out. I think I need some more cultural buildings. Uh, public order to the law. Whoop, wrong button. Uh, culture increase. All right, so roads are next. Oh, that takes a lot of money. Food, income, culture. We might have to get the brewery. Oh, minor scores. That's right. Public order, free upkeep, building is reduced, public health. Nah, I think I'd go for the brewery next. But I'm losing money, aren't I? Yep. That's I to be expected. My king. Oh, I'm gonna sneak I around them. Forward. We march Hopefully. No further today. <laughs> I don't care. Don't care. Don't care. All right, Woodland Realm. They like me. I, noble sire. Oh, the Easterns are turning back. Perfect. I, my liege. We march to glory. I, noble sire, setting a vigilant watch here. Cool. All right, so that's done. Then we have this guy. I, your name, that's done. I, noble now we have you trying to sir, find that's not Shadow of Mirkwood. Of course, sire. Of course, sire. I'm probably just have to go to Dolgulder. Dur, Dolgulder. That's annoying. All right, so end and waith. I am canceling my regular tributes. Disappointing, but good that you told us. Indeed, it is. You are we quite hope welcome. For more fruitful parley in future. I want to talk. I guess if I go this way, I can do all these people and work my way back toward here. And then probably just disband him or something. So let's go up right, here to our elven friends and dwarven allies. And you're done, and you're done. 
Hopefully this I'm army doesn't attack. Well, let's hope for the best. Please don't attack. I want to fight Gundabad and have confidence that I'm going to win. I do have confidence I'm going to win because Gundabad are a bunch of incompetent fools. Well, it's not Gundabad themselves. It's really just the orcs. But they get a garrison that I did not know about, which is annoying. Athelian attacked. Oh, no. Don't care. I lord. Oh, perfect. Ah, oh, perfect. Okay, okay. Let's do all the other stuff first. That way, as soon as the battle is over. Oh, no. Screw it. Battle now. Do the other stuff later. Ugh. Night battle increases him. Alright, so they did lose some people. These guys, the garrison, didn't lose anyone, but oh, it's whatever. Finally! We get to attack! Oh, I've been itching for a battle, and this is, episode's almost over. Ugh. Again, I apologize, but everything that I just did was necessary. I needed the reinforcements. Well, in theory. Because I don't know how this battle map is going to be. I suck at field battles, so I hope it's nothing like that. All this trade and map information stuff was necessary. Well, at least a trade was necessary. Map information, not so much. Oh, don't be a field battle. Where's the... Uh... Is that the entrance? Oh, jeez. This is going to be a nightmare for my camera. Oh, jeez. I can't tell if this... Alright, so this does appear to be where they have to go. Can I send my guys this way? Oh my god, I can send them over here. Is that totally cheating? Is it? Um... I'm gonna try it. Because if I can just rush them, then I don't need anything. Whoop. Whoop. Why can't these guys go over here? Alright, there they are. You drop it. This could totally backfire on me, too. Oh my god, that's so cheap. I love it. I don't have to funnel through there at all. Alright, let's just attack everyone. Let's send you guys, however, to just kind of... Uh, let's group them up. And group them up. Do they have any missile troops? Yeah, they have those guys. Alright, so one thing of missile troops. I'll take it. Well, this is... This is a very disappointing map. I thought it'd be better. I mean, there's that over there, but it doesn't require anything, and the orcs wouldn't have defended. I just would have walked in there. So it doesn't matter. This way is just quicker, I guess. Yes. Look at the dwarves. The miners. Alright, here we go. They're on their way. Crap. No, I want you guys to attack them, and a few of you guys to attack the others. Ah, oh, whatever. Just get in there. Oh, those archers are gonna 
tear me to shreds. How about we actually get in there? Instead of having a few people fight, get everyone to fight. Yes, just like that. Perfect. Uh, yep, attack them. Of course, all my best units are in this place. And, of course, they're doing nothing. Oh, and here comes Gimli and his merry band of dwarves. Charge! Point-blank shots doing absolutely nothing against the might of a dwarf. Clad in iron and steel. Capes blood red like the blood of their enemies. Though I guess orcs and goblins have black blood, so it doesn't matter. And if we go over here, these guys aren't doing as well, but they're they're doing good. Not bad for a bunch of miners. All right, how can I improve? All right, get you guys to go over there. Get you guys also to go over here. Probably group you guys up so I know better. The rest of you doing your thing. These guys aren't doing anything, so I'm just going to cut down the archers before attacking them. Because a thing that I always end up doing, and it's a bad idea, is I always split my people up, and then they get cornered and they die. Oh, are they going in? They're regrouping. But they're supposed to spread out. There we go. Oh, so they're just lining up. They're not even going to try to flank me. Perfect. Uh, horn ha bobble. Bobble, bobble, bobble. Oh, they work bodyguards. The miners won't be able to take them. Oh, but if they get... If they go behind and try to support these goblins, I can surround not only these goblins, but their bodyguard. Yes. Yes. Perfect. Alright, surround them. Surround them, dwarves. Make sure no goblins escape. Cut them all down. You have these guys pushing. Perfect. Kazadai Menu. And then you. Regroup two. And then we have these guys fighting the front lines. Nope, I want. Kill the bodyguard. Perfect. Uh oh. I didn't expect these guys to break off. I was trying to surround them. Oh, but they're just being cut down by the axes of the dwarves. Their helmets have small slits in them. Their eyesight is very limited. And a dwarf is short in stature, which makes their vision even harder to see. How can they kill an enemy which they cannot see? Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, attack them. Alright, let's get you in there too. Oh, the general is just surrounded. Fighting a battle that cannot win. I've only lost 16% of my guys too. That's good. Alright, this... They might be spread a little bit more thin than I would want. Uh, 
I may want to break one of these guys off to go surround them even more. Our army is tiring. Maybe not. As soon as these guys die, I'll sur I'll go around. In fact, is there anyone that can afford to break off? Yeah, maybe you guys. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Perfect. Alright, so we'll take these guys, ungroup them, have them surround and help the generals. I'm always concerned about Gloin. Because he has less people than the others. And sure, he may kick butt, but that doesn't matter if your people aren't that great. Wait, what did I just say? <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. What I meant to say was it doesn't matter how good your people are if they outnumber you too much. Or something along those lines. Yeah, his numbers are thinning. In fact, they're all getting their butts kicked a little bit. Where's, where even is the last of their, of the enemy? So I could probably break these guys off immediately if I wanted. Alright. Let's go support Gloin. Maybe put him in, nah, that doesn't matter, they're too spread. Oh, yes. Surprise attack on their flank. Alright, as far as you guys are concerned, are they all dead? Alright. So... Yeah, it doesn't matter. Just run over there. Alright, let's really get in there. Got these guys... Okay. Get out of there, Gloin. You've done well, but I don't want you to die just yet. There's no point in you dying when the battle is already won. Where are you guys going? Over here. Over here, please. Oh, please tell me he's over here. I can't tell. Just get out of there. Just retreat. Full retreat. He's supposed to be in a line. Oh, retreat. Get out of there. I swear to God, if Gloin dies because he just doesn't want to run, I'm going to be one pissed off dwarf. Oh, it's over. It is all over. Now they're completely surrounded. Alright, that's six time. The enemy general lies Good. dead. It's about time. Let the crows have his miserable bones and let our swords have his You just bed. see on the minimap they're getting smaller and smaller. Oh, poor goblins. Azul the Merciless. Only 238. Pretty good. Who got the most? Dragon Slayers. No, 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 no. Axes of Erebor. Nice. Good job, Axes of Erebor. Taking on a bunch of orcs. How much did Gloin get? 126. Ugh. 
Could have been better, Gloin, but then again, you were completely outnumbered. But you survived. That's all that matters to me, bud. Well, I think that was a successful battle. Words. They're difficult. Gundabad is now under the control of the dwarves. Glory and honor. We have lands and glory. Yeah, they're just gonna be pissed off, so I'm probably gonna exterminate them. Gundabad. There's no hope for the orcs. Alright, so try to rebuild that population. And get... Get what? I could just destroy everything. Yeah, I'm gonna just destroy as much as I can. Replace it with all dwarven stuff. It's probably what I should do for Dane's Halls, too. I do have the money to be able to do it. What's public order looking like? 135, so if I destroy that, it has, like, no effect. This does give me 20, which is good. Oh, I guess I shouldn't have destroyed the other building. Whatever. I'm just going to destroy anything that's orc and replace it with dwarf stuff. Maybe I should turn you into the thing. Well, that's good. I can work my way south. Take that fort, too. What is the fort? I like, I can't move anyone, I can I? Oh, I can move them. I Though they I won't lord. make it there. Outstanding. Relations work. Yep, that's to be expected. And that's to be expected. Alright, well that's that. Instead of putting you... Yeah, I'll put you in Dane's Halls. Maybe get free upkeep. Do them today, sire. But Lissa Towers. Does this do anything? Probably not. I don't think Ballista Towers do anything on things like that. You get 1,400 gold. I doubt I'll ever get attacked there anymore, so I'm going to get rid of it. I don't think it provided me with any bonuses. Because the same thing as Isengard. The towers just don't do anything in Orthanc. I don't think they'll do anything there. Slowly working your way back to Ron. Hey! Any of these buildings give me free upkeep? Doesn't look like it, so I'll probably get dirt, dirt paths. Increased trade goods, culture is also going to be a thing. And roads and trades. Road and trade. Yep. Alright, what else can I get? Pipe hall is being built. Miner's quarters, because I do love it. Probably save it for the miner's quarters there. That's something I should do. Just try to get all the miner's quarters in that building type done as soon as possible. Uh, what about all these guys? My lord, I cannot go there, sire. Of course, sire. Uh, they're of just course. nowhere. I'm Screw it. Go to sire. just, just go to Dolgeldur. Where's there? You are. Awaiting your command. So your closest is probably in right, just sir. this area. So do that. I believe that is everything. Let's just merge these guys up as much as possible. Yeah. I don't know if I'll be able to retrain him. Well, he'll grow over time. I am honored, Let's see about taking that orc for it at some point. I. I do believe that is everything for today, though. Rune is still 
doing weird stuff. Oh, they can attack Ron, which is a problem. I, my liege. How many turns? One, two, Making three, four turns. I will not waste take words on you. two turns at least. I think with what I have, I'd be able to defend, maybe. I will not waste words on you. I'm going to rely, have to rely heavily on my cavalry. But most of all, I'm just going to have to hope that the Easterlings don't do anything. So there's that. My king. Got my map maker. Yeah, I guess technically they're map makers because they're setting up watchtowers so I can know what's going on. But everything seems to be going well. But let me know for the Skundabad army. Should I try to attack the remnants of Agmar? Just get these few buildings over here and then work my way south? Or should I ignore them for now except for the fort because forts are easy to take and they might not have anyone? And just go south to Goblin Town, try to link up with the with Moria, my allies there. Just go south and then head back up north. Because either way, I'm going to have to backtrack. Whether if it's go over here, then backtrack down, or down here and backtrack up. Though it probably would be a smarter idea to go down and then back up. Because if I go up and then back down, I'll have to eventually go back up to take care of Agmar. And then I'll have to build another army to take care of Rude. Oh, excuse me. That was inappropriate. I'll take another army to take on Rune. And that's if Dale destroys them first. Which is totally a possibility. Oh yes, I also have the mines now. Which produce a lot of money. And I am making a lot of money still. In fact, I can probably build the market right now if I wanted. I will do that, in fact. But yeah, that's all I have for you today. I hope you all enjoyed this one hour special. And remember, if this video gets 10 likes before I record the next episode, I don't know when that will be though, then the next episode will be another hour long special or hour long episode, however you want to interpret it. Okay. And of course, it will keep going up and up and up, the amount of likes until something happens and same goes for every video from now on I'll say if this video gets X amount of likes next one will be an hour long yada 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 but until then I hope you all enjoyed and I will see you on the next one